Good morning, everyone. Chewy here. You may have noticed I haven't been doing much moto vlogging of late. Well, I haven't been doing any motorbike riding of late. I'll tell you why in this video. Good job, bin man. Hey, everyone. It all started about three years ago when I had a vision to make a music studio. Three years later, still not finished. It'll get there eventually, I hope, health permitting. So, three years ago, I was clearing out the old garage slash shed and there was a gigantic television in there, 80 kilograms. I decided to lift it and move it by myself. Not a good idea. I tripped going out through the doorway, tried to save the television, and inevitably crushed two vertebrae in my lower back, perforated two discs, L4 and L5. So I had a year of excruciating pain. Constant sciatic pain from that point. Change sides. Hey. Now, I went to my local GP and he scared me instantly and said, oh, you'll probably need surgery to fix it which instantly put me off getting any treatment. So me being me, being the stubborn person that I am. Put off going to any doctor or getting any treatment. A year later, I'd finally had enough. My poor old GP had to retire. I had a new doctor. And when I went to my new doctor, he straight away suggested that I get some scans done to find out what was going on. Had a CT scan done. It showed that there were some issues. Two perforated discs, L4, L5. Was referred to a specialist. The specialist sent me for an MRI. Oh, that was the day I figured out that I had claustrophobia and experienced my first anxiety attack or panic attack, which is really horrible. Anyone who's ever experienced a panic attack, I never actually understood what you were going through until that day. If you've never had a panic attack before or an anxiety attack before, and you don't understand what it is, might I suggest you don't judge people who've had them or are having them, or just go easy on people who are experiencing a bit of um, need. Try your best to be patient, to be kind and caring and understanding towards those people, because that is a horrible experience. So, the result of the MRI anyway, was a much more detailed set of scans which meant I could get some cortisone injections. So two years ago, the end of January 2017, I received two lots of injections. One in the December of 2016, one lot, and the second lot at the end of January 2017. And basically since then I've been experiencing only about 10% of the sciatic pain that I've been going through. After the New Year's Eve gig this year, when I was getting my equipment back from the car into my home, when I had to lift my amplifier, which is quite heavy, I aggravated the injury. So for the past seven days, I have been experiencing that full sciatic pain 
once again. Which is why I haven't been riding the motorcycle and doing any moto vlogging. So here I am, updating you on my situation by doing a face to face vlog with my Blacktown City Bowling Club cap on, sitting in the beautiful environment that is Blacktown. You can hear a bunch of birds, they're called rainbow lorikeets. I'll get a couple of photos of them for you. So today instead of moto vlogging, you get to watch me fly a drone for a little while. Some met us expanded by the cool and dull. Who's got news to teach all? What has not been taught? Divided by the roads and what is going on. Heavy words and honesty that do not fall upon. My ears are never quite as ready to hear that sense. The terrible nonsense losing all respect and down by tense Don't dip it in if you don't know just how to take it out They hunger on the weak and who do fail to cool it out
okay. I'm gonna go and pack up and go home and do some more stretches. There's my camera. Set up on my sunglasses for a nice little tripod. Seem to work all right. What I'd like to just finish off with is by saying, if you think there's something wrong, if you're in pain, don't put it off. Go and get help, go and get treatment. Life is too short and living with pain is not fun at all. I'm missing out on a lot of things that I'd love to be doing right now. Although I still had fun right now, that's great. Learning new things, it's always something that I love to do. Set myself new challenges and new goals all the time. Sometimes some of my old goals change their focus, I suppose. Music is still always a big focus and will continue to be a big focus. You can expect lots of music on this channel in 2019. There will be loads coming your way. Alright, thanks for watching. To any new subscribers, thank you very much for subscribing to my channel. If you like the content, don't forget to hit the like button. If you really like the content, please subscribe to the channel. Please consider subscribing to the channel anyway. And if you uh, got something from the message, please share it with friends and family on social media. It's of great benefit to me to try and grow my channel. My goal is to reach 1,000 subscribers by the end of this year and 4,000 viewing hours so that I can monetize my channel and turn my little hobby into a little bit of pocket money that I can reinvest into motorcycles, music and technology. All right, as always, until next time, be good to each other. Peace.